We want to check the conservative cell phone here. I'm assuming it's gear. Popular with middle-aged men. Oh, that's like a ton of defense. I like that. Cannot complain about defense in this economy, for sure. Alright, let's see. What do we have down here? Really nothing. We can take a cab up north here and then check out maybe the substory at the Popo up there. I think these guys are playing Shogi? It looks like it. Ah, some confidence in your socially, uh, your Shogi skills. Definitely not. Oh, we got a basics of Shogi. Thanks. Your moves bring you closer to victory than ruin. That's kind of foreboding, but hey, we'll take it. Alright, let's head up top. Plus, that's technically closer to Daigo as well. Plus, we haven't explored here, per se. We walked in this way, but aha! There's, like, obviously things for us to get here. Silver plates, which we will be selling eventually. I will look up to see if there's, like, anything that we need the plates for. But, obviously, the locker keys are what's going to give us some fun items and stuff like that. So, those are the things that we want to prioritize looking for and grabbing as much as possible. There's a locker key. Did I see something down this way? Nope, doesn't look it. And then we'll just do a brief little check on this little landing over here. Yep, I knew there'd be something. Take that. And then, of course, this little alcove is nothing. Okay, perfect. Let's go back to the Popo. Actually, I haven't seen the purple vending machine before. What's in here? Interesting. Mystery drink. Let's buy a couple of those just for fun. They're all mystery drinks, actually. Cool. Yep, let's go back to the Popo. Do ourselves a sub-story here. Or at least get one going. Who knows if we can actually do it. The other one was a multi-stepper, right? So, let's talk. Welcome, Popo. Would you like your bento heated up, sir? Uh, I haven't bought anything yet. Oh, um, I'm sorry. Thank you, sir. Please come again. Are, are you okay? Overcoming your fears. I, I appreciate your concern, sir, but I'm, I'm just fine, sir. Yeah. You don't seem fine. Well, the truth is, I'm new here, and I never expected retail to be so hard on my nerves. You're stressed out, I take it. There's so much to do. Delivering packages, memorizing the cigarette brands, manning the register, helping customers find things. I'm trying to juggle it all, but I'm afraid that if I mess up, I'll make a customer angry. And that's making me nervous. People really take all you convenience store clerks do for granted, don't they? But if you take it one step at a time, you'll be fine. Just take a deep breath and sort the priorities out in your head. Customers will wait if they see you're working hard for them. Y you think so? Yeah. They'd rather wait than have you mess up because you're flustered. And if there's not ever something you're not sure about, I'm sure your coworkers have your back. You know, you're right. I feel a lot better now. Thank you. No problem. Good luck. I'll do my best. All right, so we're going to have to check in on him. Is there anything back here? Nope, not really. We can check back in on him. It looks like there's an item storage thing here. I'm kind of curious to use that and see if there's anything left over. It doesn't look at which is fine. No problem, buddy. Let's check back in. It's weird that it's asking us to check in, but nothing at all. Okay, so let's see. Is there anything to grab here that's important? Insecticide. Blinds enemies. That'd be kind of nice, huh? Toughness. Lights. Let's grab a couple of those. A sushi set. Let's just buy across the board here, because sometimes there are people that want certain things... And I want to just kind of grab them all in case there's a sub story which requires somebody needing something from the C store that I can't grab, right? So let's see. Let's grab Toughness Light. Wow, that is like. Wow. We used five medicine items though, so that's good. Let's buy five more. That is like. Heals like nothing, but that's fine. Why do we not max it out? Who knows? Alright, let's check in with him a bit later and maybe start... Actually, should we grab some... Takoyaki? Why not? Let's just grab it all. You don't have to buy them, right? We can just eat them when we want. You're welcome very much. Alright. It's weird that, like, the, the newspaper ad or the radio ad got super loud for a second. Alright, let's talk to... Or let's just see what's going on over here. 
Oh god, he's gonna punch him. Please! You gotta help me! This thug's out for blood! My blood! Helping the Barker. That should be simple enough, right? You're next if you don't step off, buddy. Let's help the Barker. Sorry, but you're the one about to get stepped on. Well, look at Mr. Funny Guy. I'm gonna beat that stupid grin off your stupid fucking face. <laughs> I love how they just don't give a shit about the language they use either, because these guys are, like, technically, like... Like, country type. There we go. Let's go hit him with a bike. Oh yeah, the good stuff. Mmm, Superman that bike right on top of his body. Beautiful. Send him flying. Everyone here is going to be freaking out. We're so good though, we're helping the Barker by just absolutely tenderizing this guy in front of the public. Look, I'm sorry, pal. Just stop hitting me. <laughs> he runs away, of course. Can't run away from your problems, buddy. Good thing I came along when I did. Sure was. Guy was gonna turn my beautiful face into hamburger meat. Right, I'm just glad you're safe. I'll pay you back someday, I swear on my life. The Barker's now your ally. And just like that, we helped the Barker. Another sub-story down. And everyone synchronizes in their fear of me. <laughs> Alright, well... Now that everyone's afraid of me, let's head back to our shop guy over here and see if he's gotten any more confident. Hi there. Well, not at all. Thank you very much. Alright, okay, so. That was a sub-story started. Um, we can always come back and finish that another time. I'm sure, like, you have to go into some cutscene or story element before coming back and getting uh, made good on... Whoop! Alright. Let's fight before uh, you can finish that sub story. Just to finish my sentence. Be this guy's like a little loner over on the pack here. There we go. Beautiful. Throwing people is really helpful. I'm gonna be honest. It's the best crowd control that I can think of right now. I also think on top of the quick stuff that we want to max out, we want to max out attack speed because. The slower we are, the worse we're gonna be. And honestly, before I get to some parts of the game, which I remember, um, I definitely want to get those things going. Because the worse you are in combat, the harder and sloggier it can be. I don't mean that in a negative way, it's just that's just how things are, you know? <laughs> Even Daigo's clapping for me. How about that? Okay, so. There's only two more sub-stories on the map. I think we can leave that for now. Let's go talk to Daigo and head to... <laughs> Everyone is so afraid of me. We can head to Omi HQ. Actually, you know what? Let's... Oopsies. I forgot you can uh, do that during... Talking. Let's save real quick. Alright. Now we go and talk to Daigo and... Head to Omi HQ. Alright, there's no turning back now. Yep, this is it. Let's roll then. So let's roll. Kejisan, washa katagi odo kasu yana koto shimaen di. Nanka no machigai to chaimasu ka? Kissa ten de Kojima Fudousan no shachou ni ota toki, table o tadaita so ya nai ka? Ara tadaita uchi ni hairu maen ga na. ちょっとこうやってポーンとやっただけですわ。立派な強化剤や。冗談やないで。その間のことで一日引っ張られとったらわしら飯食うていきまへんがな。しょうもない大門ちらつかせられれば一般市民はそれだけで怯えるもんや
オム連合と登場会が杯交わせた私たちが掴んだ情報ではほんで天下の警視庁班は不敬に何せえ言うんでっか桐の身柄を確保していただきたいあもし杯の話がこじれて桐生が殺されでもしたら泥沼の構想になるのは間違いありませんからつまりわしら警察がヤクザの身辺保護をせえちゅうことでんなええとにかく時間がありませんのでよろしくお願いしますほんま勝手なことばっかり脱がしやがって課長誰からですかうんああ警視庁の四課長からやヤクザの身辺保護とはどういうことなんですか桐生一馬が監査に乗り込んできたんやと桐生ってあのああせや登場会の四代目やあいつにこっちで死なれでもしたら西と東の大戦争やせやからわしらに身辺保護をせいっちゅうどんねやアホらしいその任務私にやらせてくださいあかんあかんお前に任せたら身辺保護どころやないわチャンスやと思いませんかチャンス桐生一馬の命を守るその名目さえあれば私が関東で捜査しても問題ないということですよねなんじゃいお前の狙いは関東に乗り込んで不敬四家の力を見せつけて決勝を見返しちゃろっちゅうてのか展開によっては総動員体制も取れますこれはおもろいな差し詰め不敬四課の関東進出やな<笑>じゃあ私においちょっと待てやお前登場会にこだわっとるんと違うやろな違います私は不敬四課の主任として言ってるまでですほんまやなはいわかったほな一丁行ってこいやはいきのうの爆発風間組の事務所は粉々に吹っ飛んだそうだが柏木組長は無事だそうだそうか近江連合の仕業じゃねえだろうなおそらく合田隆二だよええああ昨日蒼天堀であった本当か<音声>お待ちしておりましたしゅんのトップフローを見つけたら、私はパパンパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカムスタンスを見つけたら、私はパパンサーカ How about you? What do you have to say to me? I apologize, sir. This elevator is reserved for the chairman's private use. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, they're making us walk. They're making the old man hoof it. That's fine. We're heading right on up to where we're supposed to be. The top floor. Head out of the chambers of the four gods. Clockwise, from lower right, they are Seryu, the Azure Dragon, Byako, the White Tiger, Suzaku, the Vermilion Phoenix, and Genbu, the Black Tortoise. Cool. Please proceed through the door right up these stairs, sir. Can we actually go this way? I'm kind of curious. Do they have anything else for us here? Like, it doesn't hurt to investigate a little bit, right? You never know, like. Hmm, maybe they dropped us, like, an item or two. Doesn't look it. Usually you're rewarded for exploring. But something else tells me we're just gonna, like, be fighting here, and now we've done all this for nothing. But that's fine. 
I wonder if things are just going to go well. You never really know. Oh, it's like a back door here. All right, we obviously can't go this way. We can't go this way, which is a bit odd, but that's fine. <laughs> We're gonna do this the alternate way and uh, head right to the, where the arrow wants us to go, I guess. Uh, we don't really have any other option right now. Come on, carry you. Oh, we're going the wrong way. There we go. Hello, sir. The interior's layout's pretty complex. Maybe it's meant to slow down intruders? You're not wrong. The chairman is a connoisseur of antiques. The pottery adorning, adorning our facility was handcrafted by master artisans. They are literally priceless. Each and every one of them is a unique masterpiece. Well, we'll be probably breaking those if there's a fight. Just up these stairs, please. How about this guy? What do you want to say? I see you're intrigued by the unique layout of the building. The facade is modeled after the Gota Crest. On the floor plan on the Omi Alliance sigil. Can we break these? Fuck yeah. Let's see what you have to say now about antiques. Yeah, that's what I thought. Nothing different. <laughs> Alright. Let's go actually talk to said chairman. Potentially. Oh, there's an equipment box here. We better save again, because we've made some... We can't... Uh-oh. Straight into the back, sir. ご大名大見連合会長の合田仁と申します。桐生四代目の噂は金がねえ。ご丁寧な挨拶。痛み入ります登場会四代目桐生和馬です片苦しい挨拶終わりにして大見連合の執行部を紹介しましょう私の横におるんが総本部長の高島です本部長やった寺田の公認となりますよろしくお願いします寺田のええ寺田いや登場会五代目とは兄弟分でしたこの度は誠に残念でした次にちょっと待ったおいそこのあんた今なんて言った残念だと何寝ぼけたこと言ってんだお前らがやったんだろうが寺田を殺したのは
知らねえとは言わせねえぞ確かにですがあれは私や執行部の仕業ではありまへん何だと今更何言ってんだ桐生さん堂島さん合田の口からは申し上げにくい話なので私の方から説明いたします実は1年前の神宮との件は直産合流会会長が独断で行ったことなんです何龍二が龍二をご存知でしたか彼は親父の実施です親の心こしらずとはこのことで奴は近江の大門を使って勝手な行動を次々寺田襲撃を実行したのも合流会によるものかと思いますでは龍二が寺田殺しを命令したとおそらくはアホらしいやっとらいわ戦国まああとは勝手にやっとくんなり寺田のコーディング必要やったら声かけてくださいや10億でも20億でも用意しますさかいほうな桐生さんこれが近江連合の現状です直参120構成員3万5千巨大になりすぎた組織を統制するのは至難の技です5代目この高島は和光で器量もある寺田もそうやったですがね今の戦国や龍二のように他の若い連中は言うことを聞かへん豪太さん桐生さん寺田を失うたんは東条近江関係なく痛いことや今こそ東と西の力を均衡させることで争いの種を取り除きたいと私は思ってる東と西のですかそうです桐生さんあんたならそれができるぜひ東条会を立て直してくださいそのために近江連合の力が必要なら私は喜んで力になります。会長との杯を願っていました寺田登場会としては寺田の願いに従い近江との五分の杯を望んでいます受けていただけますか<笑>お受けいたしますそうですかではすぐにでも東条会五代目代行の堂島弥生をこちらに向かわせますいやそうはいきまへん今度はこちらから出向く番ですカムロ町へ行きましょうはいありがとうございます違いちゃうんかお前何しに来たお前は執行部の人間やないあ,あ何や俺を覚えているだろうチールンお前に5年前はめられた堂島宗平の息子大悟だよチールンチュートルやろが杯なんて関係ねえ俺はお前に借りを返さなきゃならねえんだよザコなんぞ覚えてられるか邪魔やねそこで寝とけどないする気ややれ
何をするどういうことやお前ここどこだと思ってんだ何言うてもんねん大海連合の本部だぞそのようなことは分かっとるまんがわしらはクーデターを起こしに来とんのやからなんだと今は登場会さんにうちの親父と話しさせるわけにはいきませんね坂月なんぞ顔してしもたわしの計画がパイお前の狙いはやはり戦争なのかそうや西と東の大戦争それこそがわしの狙いやそれとも一つ俺かその通りあんたの首や悪いがその価値があるか試させてもらいますぜ